concise communication. Two cases of chronic oral ulcers effectively treated with systemic corticosteroid therapy, circumorificial plasmacetosis and traumatic ulcerative granuloma with stromlyosinophilia. Yuko Kuriyama Akira Shimizu Sayaka Toki Yuki Endo Masahiro Yasuda Sichiro Motagi Osamu Ishikawa First published, October 31, 2018 DOI.org web link Read the full text Tools share Abstract Chronic oral ulcers are induced by various causative factors. Biopsy from an active site around ulceration is critical for both the definitive diagnosis and proper treatment. We report two cases of chronic oral ulcers, circumorificial plasmacetosis, CP, and traumatic ulcerative granuloma with stromlyosinophilia, TUGS. A 65-year-old man presented with a mucosal ulcer on the right half of the lower lip. The dense plasmacytic inflammatory infiltration was histologically consistent with CP. A 32-year-old woman presented with a mucosal ulcer on the right mouth comma sure. The dense mixed inflammatory cell infiltrates composed of acinophils, lymphocytes and histiocytes extending from the submucosal tissue to underlying striated muscle fibers were histologically consistent with TUGS. PO administration of corticosteroid was effective in both cases. A broad differential diagnosis is required for chronic oral ulcers. If the oral ulcer did not respond to the first therapy, clinical re-evaluation and biopsy is essential. Publication cover image. Early view. Online version of record before inclusion in an issue. Related. Information. Metrics. Details. Copyright 2018 Japanese Dermatological Association Keywords <laughs>